there, people of the internet. I am Christina, also known as Life Simmer, and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 4 Get To Work Part 1. So, I am going to do a introduction on myself. I am Christina, like I said previously. I'm your typical teenage girl. Yes, I'm a girl. <laughs> my voice is gone right now. I've been sick all week, and it took my voice with it, so... I typically, I don't sound like this, but uh, it happens. I'm not an old man. I wish, but uh, yeah, bear with me in this part. Filming commentary is pretty hard right now. Anyways, I don't really know how to describe myself. Uh, the best way I could just describe myself is um, an excitable, happy potato. Potato, yes, everyone, potato. Uh, if you don't understand what a potato is, I'm sure you like see the the vegetable. I think it's a vegetable, right? Um, everything you think a potato's personality would be is me. So, anyways, let's go ahead and jump into the gameplay. I hope you guys enjoy. Heading into the map view, we can actually select a world clicking on these three little circles now, which I think is really convenient. A little bit cuter than how they had it set up before as well. And, of course, we got a new world, Magnolia Pyramidod, which, sadly, I'm going to tell you guys straight up, there's only four lots in the world, which are mostly industrial and not so much residential. So, if you, you know, want to move here, you could, but uh, it's a little difficult. So, I took it upon my little potato noob building skills and built this really really quaint little starter home so our little starter home isn't very fancy or avant-garde but it's home for now and it will only get better Yay! Finally, we're doing live gameplay. I know, I've rambled so much in this part. It's part one. There's a lot of talking that has to be done. Uh, but for those who probably have questions regarding create a sim items, objects, if I'm going to show them, I will be doing separate videos solely dedicated to those sorts of things. Um, later tonight, I just need to definitely rest my voice for a little bit. But uh, anyway. Um, we're gonna start off with Bellatrix Nova, my alien. I am so in love with her. She is purple, by the way, if you can't tell. She's purple and gorgeous, and purple is my favorite color, so kind of had to choose it. <laughs> but Bellatrix Nova, pretty much, because she is so, I guess you can say, different, unique, men are a little scared of her. Her lifetime aspiration is to find the one true love. <laughs> she really wants to find somebody, maybe even a human sim, that loves her for her. Now, of course, it's a little hard being her, but uh, she's a loner, insane, a genius, but also alluring at the same time. And with her, you know roots of being a little different and having that solar knowledge she does want to join the scientist career and work with all of the scientific goodness in the world so here's bellatrix nova we're gonna head up to jade green jade is going to be my fashionista entrepreneur she's going to hopefully work her way up to owning a retail store where we will design outfits put them out on display and it will be super 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 cute jade on the hand is a little materialistic clumsy outgoing but she's definitely business savvy she's all about money i mean hopefully <laughs> no promises on to brody jetson he is going to be my police officer yep mr brody he's a hottie with a body so hot i love him um Anyways, yes, I find him very, very good looking. Brody is a little ironic. He is the chief of mischief. He's not exactly the best police officer. And when I say that, I mean in the sense that he does have a little bad boy in him. He does like to get into trouble. He does like to mess with people. But he, at the end of the day, wants to take up a profession that he would have authority. So I guess he's taking up a police, police officer role so he can... Uh, 
you know, arrest people and take mug shots and do all that good stuff. He's a little special. He's also a little bit of a Casanova. He does like the ladies. He's a romantic, not commitmental, hates children, and a little dastardly. So Brody's Brody's my special one. Brody's very Brody's just I would say Brody. <laughs> He's just uh special. <laughs> On to Mr. Lovey Love right here. He's so cute. He's so flipping cute. I love Lovey. I want to give him a big hug. He wants to have a big family. He wants to have kids. Do all that good stuff. Um, He's just always been very nurturing. I guess we could say very nurturing. Very, very, very family orientated. It's just what he's passionate about, I guess we could say. So he decided that being a doctor would definitely be one of the best things he could do for himself because he loves to nurture people. He loves taking care of others. What a better profession than um, becoming a doctor. So he's very neat, ambitious, family oriented, and of course domestic. So yeah, those are my four Sims. Hopefully you guys got their names and all of that. I know I sound a little scary right now, but uh, I hope you guys got that. <laughs> so I think First things first. Oh, actually, hold on. I need to show you guys our little house really quickly. Here is the boys' room upstairs. Um, look how cute this little mice sim is. How cute is he? I'm in love with it. And then if we head downstairs, I did get a little funky down here. I would say I spent a little bit more um, down here than upstairs. I just thought it was so cute. I have like these little stickers on the wall, a mannequin so he can dress it up and change its pose and all of that. And also a really pathetic bathroom down here, <laughs> but it's a bathroom. So what we need to do right off the bat is actually get our jobs. So I'm gonna have everybody, oop, wrong, wrong sim. Um, Bellatrix is going to Find a job. And she is going to be in the scientist career. She's going to be a lab technician. She works from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Makes 24 simoleons per an hour. There we go. And let's head up here to Brody. Gonna have him find a job. And Levy will be next. <laughs> he is going to be a detective. He's going to be a cadet. Um, he works from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and makes 20 simoleons per an hour. And last but certainly not least is Mr. Levy. He is going to go ahead and find a job as well. He is going to be a doctor. So he is going to be hired as a medical intern. He's going to work from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. And he makes 18 simoleons per an hour. Alright, cool. Everybody has their little careers started. So, um, let's see. She needs to have two breakthroughs. Um, while gardening, reading, or performing experiments, I guess scientists can have breakthroughs. So, we're going to have her go ahead and read that for a little while. Uh, Brody, actively participate in the workday of a detective. So he actually needs to go to work to do that. And then Levy needs to attend an active work day as the doctor. Jade is a little different. She needs to buy a retail store before we can really get into all of that. So we are going to be doing that. Um, we'll, we'll go ahead and check it out. We definitely do not have the simoleons for it right now. All right. So as you can see, we have like definitely not even close. We have about 700 simoleons. <laughs> And to even purchase this little plot of land right here, it is 3,000 simoleons. So we're going to have to collect about 10,000 simoleons or so and purchase that little lot of land and build a little itty bitty baby store. But until then, we don't even have that. <laughs> so I think I'm going to leave Jade at home. I'm not going to have her um, go out and get a job. I'm going to have her be my home sim until she, you know, gets into her whole retail groove and all of that stuff. 
All right, so I think it would be kind of fun to take a few selfies. Selfies are back, and they're really, really cute. I think this is the best selfies that we've... That, that doesn't even make sense. The best selfies that we've received in The Sims yet. So I'm going to have... I, I don't even know their names yet. Miss Jade, take a couple of selfies. And ooh, girl, that selfie's real cute, though. I'll go ahead and click. I'm going to filter it. Turn flash on. And, um... We're going to do... Ooh. This filter right here. This looks nice. And, uh, just gonna move it like that. Okay. Seems like a cute one. Let's see. She acquired the photography skill. Yes, photography is back, which is really, really awesome. Your Sims can actually, as they improve their photography and painting skill, they can, um, ooh, what is this light bulb? What is this? Oh, she's making a breakthrough. Hold up. Eureka! Bellatrix Nova has her first breakthrough and wrote down an idea for the Momentum Conserver. Click on the notebook button at the top of the phone menu to learn more about it. So that's actually really cool. So she had a breakthrough. Eureka! Okay, cool. So to get to the notebook, you pretty much go right here. And uh, no ingredients required to make the Momentum Conserver. Anyways, like I was saying, as you skill up in the photography skill and your sim has good painting skill, they can kind of take it hand in hand and paint some of their photos. It's really, really cool. So let's go ahead and pull out our selfie. And I did purchase a better camera, so we're going to have to pull that out as well. And here it is. Let's see. Let's take a photo of something. A Bellatrix. <laughs> That's an amazing photo. Oh, no. And, of course, because they're not very good at the photography skill quite yet, our thumb is in the way. That was such a good photo. I'm so mad. Take another one. Hopefully, I got it this time. I did, thankfully. Bellatrix. And I think we're going to take, take a photo with... Uh, let's take a photo with Brody. I love her. I love the the whole breakthrough thing. It's actually quite easy to follow. Um, to see how your Sims are making the breakthrough. I think that little light bulb has to fill up and then you get your little breakthrough. He's like, sure. Upload it to Instagram. <laughs> this is so cute. Oh my goodness. Possibly the cutest thing I've ever seen. Selfie. <laughs> I'm going to put it in a couple of different filters. Selfie. Selfie. <laughs> I love it. It's so cute. Seriously. I am head over heels in love with the selfies. Let's go ahead and put a few down. Oh, they're so cute. That one has a gnome. Oh, damn you, gnome. Damn you, gnome. At least I got those. Damn you, gnome. <laughs> oh, I also bought this really cool mailbox. How cute is it? It's an alien mailbox. It's so cute. But um, they don't have work until... Until tomorrow. So... We're pretty much good for today. I say we build friendships with our roommates. I'm gonna have Bellatrix go talk to Brody. Oh, look. How convenient. She is going to analyze his personality. <laughs> All right, let's see. Low brain power. Oh, no. It's probably time to rest and, recro and recover some brain power. Brody has discovered that Bellatrix Nova is an alien. Oh, the disguise seemed perfect. Um, Brody, she's not wearing a disguise. <laughs> and let's see. 
Oh, he's totally, he's loving it. He's loving it. He loves that she's an alien. So that's one thing your aliens can actually do. They can disguise themselves. So, um, I'll show you guys really quickly. If I click disguise herself, this is apparently Bellatrix. <laughs> I can change it if I wanted to, which I think I will. Um, off camera, but, uh, you can make your sim or your alien kind of seem more normal <laughs> if you wanted to. So I say we apologize to Brody and say that he's seeing crazy things. And we'll also give him a pickup line since we are, you know, quite the flirties. He's totally not into it. He's like, I saw you. Don't even try. We're going to remove our disguise really quickly. Whatever. Whatever, Brody. We truly are an alien, but whatever. Aww. And she's feeling so awkward. Poor thing. Ugh, where can I hide? <laughs> Brody's under there, too. Oh, she's going to go chill. Jade, what are you going to do? She's going to put a book away. Say, is she going to read? Is she really going to read? All right, she's going to get to know Brody. And Bellatrix will, I guess, um, share her insecurities to Levy. All right, so yeah, I want everybody to kind of get to know each other a little bit. Brag about our possessions. Please, what do we have? Ask about his day. We will. Tell him a funny story, do an impression, all that good stuff. Levy has discovered that Bellatrix Nova is an alien. He better get used to it. Discovered. They, oh, they saw right through my clever disguise. Let's see. I believe there's not um, any new activities that we can actually place down and do. Um, other than the chemical analyzer, which we can find at work and the cameras um there's the photo studio which i mean you know we don't really re need right this second um nothing new in the recreation nothing new in athletic and the only thing new in here are the jail cell bars and mannequins and that's it there's like no new activities to actually do but um, it's it gets really interesting once we go to work. First parts are a little different. You don't really get to do too much. I'm excited for the next part. I can go to work. I'm so excited to go to work. <gasps> Actually, I know what we're going to go do. <laughs> Levy is going to take up the baking skill. <gasps> yes, that's right. He's going to go bake. There's a baking skill. He's very family orientated. I don't know if it's like Martha Stewart sort of thing. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't know. I just see Levy being a little bigger. So, he's going to come over here and make some pre-mixed brownies. Let's see. It's pretty simple. <laughs> All right, Levy has newly acquired the baking skill. It will allow him to combine butter, sugar, and other ingredients into tasty bites. Mm -hmm. And he made his green salad. Boy, you better come eat it. Mm -mm. No, no, no. Come eat. Come on, Brody. Ooh, Eureka! Bellatrix Nova has her second breakthrough and now wrote down an idea for the syn synthetic food serum. Click on the notebook button at the top of the phone menu to learn more about it. Our synthetic food. We just need any any plant to make synthetic food. Pretty cool. Pretty freaking cool. We've had our two little breakthroughs. I say she's, she's good for now. She doesn't need to continue reading. She's a little hungry though. So, I mean, I guess she can wait for the brownies. Yum, 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 yum. Okay. She's going to come grab a bowl or a plate. And Jade will also grab a plate of a brownie. That made no sense. <laughs> wow. I don't even have a sink. I should probably get that. 
Um, maybe someday. Maybe someday, but not today. Um, when I end this part, I am going to skip until the next morning so we can go to work. But the real question is, who do you guys want to go to work with? Do you want to go to work with Bellatrix, Brody, or Levy? I'm kind of feeling Bellatrix. I you. I'm but I'm kind of feeling Brody. Oh! Jade has discovered that Bellatrix is an alien. Poor thing. She's having a rough day. <laughs> Lovey hasn't taken a selfie, so. Oh, he can get his little guy in it, too. Okay. Okay, there we go. Now I got more selfies. This is what I'm doing in my first part. It's taking selfies and lots of them. Because I love them. They're so cute. Okay, so um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. I am so sorry. I am sincerely sorry for my voice. Um, I hope it didn't ruin the part. There's really not much I can do. And uh, yeah. Anyways, I will see you all next time. I'm probably going to record another part in a little while and upload it for you all. Anyways, I love you all so much. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.